All right, let me just make sure that I am recording because the last time I tried to record, I forgot to hit the record button. What's going on, y'all? Hello, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to yet again, another video for today, man. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm sore, I'm tired. I don't really feel like doing nothing. So we're doing a reaction for today. Before we begin though, say a couple things. So for the past week, I have been trying to get back into skating, you know, making it a more of a daily thing or every other day, just trying to get back on the board, bro. Ever since coronavirus, that, the, the crazy thing is like, you know that moment when you're like, as a skateboarder, when like, there's just a light bulb and like something goes off and you're like, oh, and then the way that you approach tricks and just everything changes. Once you start to realize how to manipulate the board and get more comfortable, like that light bulb was finally starting to set off for me, right? Coronavirus hit, bro. And I'm not gonna lie, I just didn't skate that whole time. I just didn't skate. And now, you know, I'm trying to get back into it. And my goal really is to just get the basics down. So like all these kick flips, heel flips, I don't wanna move on it's like anything difficult until I feel like I have those solid. I want to build a good solid foundation. So that's why we're uh, doing this react video because skateboarder, skateboard legend, Nigel Houston. Now the thing about Nigel Houston is he is three years older than me or four years older than me, something like that. But basically I've been able to see his career since he was like a kid all the way up until now just you know seeing clips just seeing life you know moving because it does not stop moving but yeah looking at him today one thing about his flip tricks is like here let me just give you an analogy you remember when you were in like middle school type shit stuff like that and you had the magnets right the magnets they would that's Nigel houston in a skateboard except he's like i've never seen <laughs> i've never seen another skater be able to ex execute tricks like in that kind of way. It's it's a it's a crazy thing. So today we are going to be checking out the best of Nigel Houston, his best moments, according to this YouTube video. Because um I just YouTube searched it and that's it. And we're gonna check it out. <laughs> but if you do like this video, make sure to drop a like. If you're new to the channel, if it's your first time seeing me, hey, consider subscribing. But without further ado, I'm gonna stop talking and we're gonna get into it and we're gonna learn because I, I, that's how I learn. If, if I look and if you show me like kind of how to do it in a way, I can observe and then take something away from it. I'm just that type of learner. So let's go ahead, let's get right into it. So here we go. Man, mean front side flip, tray flip, or switch, switch tray flip. Does this man even consider anything switch anymore? Oh, I actually know where this is. Whoa. Man, bro. The balance, bro. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. Oh my gosh. And it's so crazy because things on camera like never do justice. Like that, this alone is so much bigger in person. Crazy. You see what I'm talking about? The way it's like the board just is like magnetized, like. Complete control, like I mean, what, what was that? Backside flip to a lip slide or something like that? Yo. Yo, I'm just saying, bro. I didn't expect him to have the balance like that, though. I've always seen him do like uh, massive flip tricks, but like grind. I think I gotta go. Uh, Cause if you see, then you gotta know. Uh, this must be like a part. Come on, you know how the story go. Why does it look like this? It's HD. His logic. Okay. What was that, Smith? Dude is clean. That's another thing I'm trying to work on is um, like really moving while I'm doing my tricks because I don't want to be just stationary 
every time I think I gotta go. Uh, and low key, it's, it's easier to do them while you're like just like moving, you know. She came with a couple of friends, tell them to come on in. I was wondering, do you need someone to fill you in on the reg? Nigga, to get the fuck by when you mad at me. I'm hitting that pussy, stand up on the wall again. No gravity, King Chip is what good observation. He gonna keep living while you keep observating. Jesus, bro, calm down. I like that spot right there. This is a really cool spot. They really brought out a whole dirt bike. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> song is hard. Oh, cricky. Oh, cricky, cricky. That's his private park, right? Yeah, this, this, I think this is his private park. Jesus, bro. I've never, bro. I'm not gonna cap. I've never hit a hand rail. These shits are terrifying. I'm not on that level yet. But you just, again, you just see it in all his flip tricks. Just the way the board is just like right there under his feet every single time. It's crazy. Ray flip to like what 5 0? Jesus, bro, man. It's crazy. And like I said, like, seeing all that is like, do you even have a switch at this point? A switch stand? What stance is Nigel? I should not have looked that up. I'm gonna need to look that up. Tail slides. Tail slides are so like just pretty. Hands down, my favorite, favorite, favorite grind. Overcrook. That was an overcrook, right? Hell no, nah, bro. I want a flip. <laughs> Hell no. Nah. That's all the people. Bitches, they only care about the flow. Uh, come on, you know how the story go. Uh. Okay, mean front side shove. <laughs> Yo, his his private part go hard though, kind of low key. Color schemes and everything is nice. Bro, oh, I know that feeling. My ankles are tore up, bro. What? All tore up. But he looks so different from when he was like a kid. I mean, that's that's called aging, bro. But <laughs> he looks so different. It's crazy. You think he'll ever get the dreads again, Nigel? Grow out your hair, bro. Get the dreads back. I think I think it's the look. We need we need that look back. I'm for it. I'm for it. What? Jesus, the balance, bro. Oh, that is a beautiful spot. Tabletop, yup. The balance on that 50 50. Okay. All that speed, I want to. The board went to flew like right under me. Nah. Bro, that was nice. That was clean. That was nice. Bro, you see what I'm talking about? Hold on, pause right there. Pause right there. You see what I'm talking about? Just the way that the board, like... I mean, like, every pro does it. You know, every pro does it. But there's just the, something about the way that he does it, bro. Just, like... It's just, like, magnets. Just every time. Just, like... Every single time, bro. Like, I've seen those things at like the gas station. Hold on, I just seen that. I see these things at the gas station all the time, and I've thought about this. 
I was like, there's no way anyone can ollie that high. I think it's the next one. Where's it at? Oh, no. I passed it. I passed it right here, right here, right here. Like, these little bars right here. I see them all the time at gas stations. I was always thought about this. I mean, hey, he can do it. And he did it, bro. He did it front side. Oh, what's that back side? Either way. You know what I'm Fuck no. What? I would look at that rail and be like, hell no, nah, bro. I'm good. There's a lot of grinds in this. A lot of hand rails, I should say, actually. Is that the Hollywood? Bro, I'm sorry. The Hollywood, uh, where he's at right now, that place dirty. I went over there. That place is dirty. I don't even know how he's skating over there. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Bro is nutty. He don't even like... He loves this handrails. Best of the best. That man love him some handrails. Top shelf. Those shoes go hard. Caviar, what are shoes are them? Those. Bella. I wonder if those are his pro models. Those shoes go Bella. hard. Will Smith, black bottles, chill shit. Y'all skate with watches on? I don't All think I could presents. skate with a watch on. Raw presents, dog clever, gold dog the weight. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Bro, here. I said this before in the video. I would love to skate something like this. I've never. I've never, because it's like in a school. Like where I'm from, we don't have schools like this. Maybe like one, one spot in the front, maybe, but that's it. At least my school. You got in the private park. I love the color scheme of his private park. The purple and the green. And uh, whoever painted that shit on the back too, that should go hard. Jesus, Trey Flip, what, 50 50? You crazy, bro. I'm I, throwing that, just throwing that shit down the stairs, bro. You're crazy. Damn. Damn, bro. And again, like these spots are a lot bigger in person. Camera, camera never does justice in anything. So y'all get it. Go outside. You know what I'm saying? Get some fresh air. Cameras don't do justice. One thing I I noticed that he's very like, you know, very uh, what's the word that I'm looking for? Um, he does a lot is like his posture and the way he squats down on the board. That's something that I've noticed. It's the same every single time. His back is in like this arch, not arch, but like type angle. Shoulders squared to Sacrifice. his knees, always Custom in the same squatting position. It never off. changes. Not even with the tricks. Really Not even with the tricks. Like and that's the issue that I look at. It's like you'll feel like you're either. Oh, I'm to it. You'll feel like you're either going too far forward or too far back, and then to feel like what it feels like to truly be over the top of the board once you actually feel that feeling it changes everything because like i remember the first time that i like felt that like i did like an ollie and i was like oh i'm actually like um this is this is what it's supposed to feel like bro <laughs> that was a, it's a workout on the ankles the calves like once you do it correctly it's like bro it's a game changer you won't you won't know though because for the longest i didn't realize that i was like leaning my issue was like i was leaning too far back to the point where i didn't even realize it but once you once you feel it once you feel the correct that one time that one time is all it takes once you feel the correct proper positioning correct footing like 
you know once you feel it you're like oh okay this is what i'm supposed to be doing is that nolly I don't know what's Nolly, what's Switch for this man. It's like it don't even matter at this point. That's crazy. The setup that you have to keep. Oh my gosh. Constantly resetting up, resetting up. Ooh, she got me fucked up. Look at this guy. Oh, that was a good clip. The cameraman, whoever did that, applause to you, bro. Man. That's every time that that position he, he locks into it every time and i've noticed that with uh let's check it out what are we gonna do here mean okay that was him at street league right yeah crazy damn what was i saying though just his positioning and then the technique i i've oh yes what i've noticed about like skateboarding is like if you do the technique correct sometimes you don't even have a choice to like you you will land correctly if you do the footwork technique properly and right and everything right you gonna land the trick whether you like it or not but that is it that is it for this video guys i hope you didn't enjoy it. i didn't expect to see him do so many handrails but i still did learn something about his how how he approaches just flip tricks if you don't know something if you don't know how to do something make sure to check out the people who do it the best but that is it uh thank you for watching my name is vicio until next time peace 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 i'll see you guys later